Have you ever thought of using soya spice to make grilled fish? Oh my goodness, you definitely have to try this recipe because it is super juicy, tasty, savory, you name it. So let us jump right in. Right here, I'll be using one whole croaker fish. It has been scaled, gutted, perfectly washed. You can use any fish of your choice, okay? For our ingredients, I will be using my soya spice. My homemade soya spice is here. I will drop the recipe for you guys. I also have some salt, seasoning powder, paprika, and onion powder. Adding some lemon juice. With cooking oil, go ahead and mix everything until well combined. The next thing is to score the fish. You want to score it deep until at least it touches the bone. Score both sides of the, of the fish, then we're gonna marinate perfectly. So when you're marinating, make sure that the marinade gets deep inside the fish, okay? Before marinating, you want to pack dry the fish to get rid of excess water or moisture. I'll now transfer that into my rack. I will be serving mine with some roasted or grilled plantains as well. You can serve yours with any side of your choice, okay? So guys, at this point, I will apply some oil spray on the plantains. I'm using canola oil. Any cooking oil is going to work. So this is going to go to the oven. I will set the timer. It's already on roast and it's going to go at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 10 minutes each side. So this is my oven. I will drop the rest. I will drop the link for you guys to buy it. It's on sales at this point. I love this because I will add a little bit of water in here to keep my fish moist all through cooking. If you do not have the oven please this particular oven you can use a regular oven the grill broil or roast option is going to work perfect so this has been perfectly cooked you can go ahead and serve that right away so guys this is so flavorful like soya grilled fish oh my god just imagine how that combination is super delicious thank you so much for watching to this point also, don't forget to check the description box or the comment section because I'll be dropping the detailed recipe for you guys to check it out. See how juicy, flaky, and fully cooked that is. So make sure you try this recipe, okay? And if you have any questions whatsoever, just drop it below and tell me again. Bye for now.